this Saturday night, April 20th, from Madison Square Garden in New York, undefeated welterweight Terrence Bud Crawford puts his WBO title on the line against 32-year-old Englishman Amir King Khan. Amir Khan does not have the perfect record that Terrence Crawford does, but he has a lot of name notoriety and a huge following and a victory for Terrence Crawford against Amir Khan. As silly as people want to make it sound, would be the biggest name win on Terrence Crawford's resume. For this fight, Amir Khan is teaming up once again with former trainer Virgil Hunter. Amir Khan has gone through a couple of trainers in his boxing career. He was with Joe Goosen last and in 2010 made his American debut being trained by multiple time trainer of the year Frey Roach. Roach recently spoke to Boxing Social and didn't have the best things to say about Amir Khan's chances against Terence Crawford this weekend. This is what Frey said, quote, Amir has all the skill in the world and he has a lot of power but at some point he will go for the knockout and when he does he gets himself in harm's way and gets knocked out. In all the fights he's been knocked out, he's been ahead. Crawford is a good fighter. Amir has better speed and footwork. But I believe Amir will be knocked out somewhere along the way because he has bad habits. Unquote. Having not such a good beard or being chinny is a, is a reputation that has followed Amir Khan ever since his first career loss in 2008 when he was obliterated by British Prescott in round one. This ESPN pay-per-view fight, Terence Crawford versus Amir Khan for the WBO welterweight title, is going to be at 147 pounds. Khan has never lost at 147 pounds, and that's the mindset that him, Virgil Hunter, and his team are going in with to face the champion this upcoming Saturday night.